Hello and welcome to episode 29 of Let's Play The Sims 3 University Life. In the last episode, we threw a wedding party for Tina and Eugene, and they are now married. Um, right now, Marcus is at work, um, sucking up to his boss. He comes, well, he, like, kind of just left, so he'll come home later tonight. Um... I changed Tina's outfit back to her normal outfit. Now, of course, I can't change her skin color, so she will be green since she is a plant sim. Um, but yeah, so she's just uh, a green sim now. Um, and then Valerie over here is sketching. Um, she has work in three hours. I actually want her to scan some artwork because that's she needs a little bit more boost on that of her work uh, performance. So Eugene has upgraded a few things and he has work in like three days because he, he can settle in from the wedding and stuff like that. So, and he's doing perfectly fine. So I'm going to focus on his, um, skills more. So I'm going to have him go ahead and what should we do? Well, right now he's going to read something, but I'm going to have him go upstairs. Actually, you know, what? I'm going to have him go to the library and read some books and, uh, some skill books. And then, um, right now, actually, I figured out that I totally forgot about Tina's lifetime wish, and that is to reach level 10 in the science skill and then reach, reach level 10 in any scientific, medical, or business career. So I'm actually going to have her quit, uh, being self-employed as a gardener and start, start a, uh, job in the scientific career. So we're going to have, we're going to do that now. Um, so we're going to go ahead and quit work and then, um, we're going to go to the science, uh, station thingy, <laughs> the, uh, and we're going to join the science career. So let's just do that. And, uh, that should be good for her lifetime wish. We'll still garden and things like that, um, which actually she needs to tend to her garden now, which, um, yeah, so we'll still, like, garden and stuff, but, uh, she's gonna mainly be in science careers just to focus on her lifetime wish. Um, also, in the last episode, we found out that the forbidden fruit, uh, is dead. <laughs> so, and we didn't, did we, I mean, we got one, right? Or maybe, oh, yeah, we got one and we planted it again. Um, it's horrifying quality, which is bad. I'm kind of tempted to have Eugene come out and, oh, never mind, he's not home. <laughs> Okay, so everyone's kind of out, but um, when Tina comes back home, she'll be able to tend to the garden. Um, so I'm going to have Eugene stop doing that. And uh, this bookshelf here, it has all of the skill books. So we're going to do, let's do logic right now, and then later we'll do other things. Because um, he wants to read a book in logic. So, all right, so congratulations. Tina just got a new job. Tina needs to be at the Land Grab Industries science facility on Thursday so it's tomorrow it might actually not be tomorrow because um okay I thought maybe it was wasn't because maybe she still can settle in from her wedding but um she does have work tomorrow so that's just just a count toward her lifetime wish and uh hopefully it'll probably her, she'll probably level up her work soon because I mean look at already her mood's like fantastic um I think science with the, with the science career you need um fishing as well so we'll have to work on that too uh but um <laughs> we can fish in this here no that's a a painting or a, a street art that valerie did all right so i'm just gonna speed through her um just uh doing this no we're not going to travel to europe <laughs> um i'm gonna actually have uh marcus meet some co-workers now um it looks like a lot of our plants are dying now so we're gonna probably have to replant them what was this just a tomato oh no that's yeah, just a tomato plant will be okay. Um, oh, these plants are dying as well. I really don't really care about a lot of these plants. I just want um, to plant these uh, red berry beans, or was it the Kona beans? Uh, I think it was the red berry beans. Um, I don't know. Maybe both, because they produce the most money, so we'll just replant those. Um, Alright, so... This looks like it's, oh, it's perfect quality. So I'm going to have her actually commune with the plant. We'll compliment it and get to know and ask about day. And I think that that actually helps it become a plant sim baby. So we can try to do that. Um, so she'll just talk to it and it'll talk back to her and stuff. So um, she wants to commune with five plants. I guess we can commune with the other ones as well. Um, the ones that are alive at least. Uh, she can do this. We'll just compliment them. And... Um, I guess this uh, helps with their growth and stuff, but, uh, yeah. So, Marcus is coming home. He did not get a promotion, I don't think. He probably got a promotion. Oh, his mood isn't that good. Huh, he's stressed. I all look at him as little, um, like, 
what is it, paper boy outfit. Um, okay, so he's just gonna go home and he'll probably just like watch TV or something like that. Uh, he has a lot of books in his inventory. Um, I don't know, but I think I'll just put them away. Let's go upstairs and put them away. Because I know that they're, his books that he wrote are in here too, or maybe they're not. I don't know, whatever. We'll just put them away. Uh, I, I do keep this one because I believe that this is the one that uh, they need to study when they go back to university, which they will soon. Um, I'm kind of worried about when they, if they do go back, if um, they they lose their job, like perform, like uh, progress. So I'm kind of afraid about that. But um, you guys can tell me if that does happen because uh, if we have to go back and they're we have to restart their job all over again, that's gonna kind of suck. So. Yeah, but um, now let's have Eugene study science, and uh, since he leveled up in logic, um, let's see, yeah, he definitely needs to level up his science um, right now, because um, he's pretty low compared to his other skills. Um, Marcus is still stressed, but he's just gonna um, play some soccer. Um, Valerie got a raise, six million raise. Um, no, don't play soccer with Tina, no, just don't, just stop, please. Mm -hmm. Come on, okay. And then uh, after she's done communing with the plants, I'm going to have her dispose all of her. Oh, she's she needs to take a shower. See, it says that you can swim to get your water uh, hydrated or whatever, but I tried that in the pool. Maybe it's in the ocean. I don't know. Um, all right. Tina, stop crying. Okay, just shower, and then you can dispose of the dead plants. Um, Marcus is going to drink some juice. Let's, um, let's have him watch some TV. And then, uh, what does play online mean? Play online with... What does that mean? Does that mean, like, oh, play a video game online with someone? Let's do that, actually. That's cool. I didn't even know that was possible. Um, let's play with Eugene, even though he's not even here. Um, no. Let's play with a cyclone sword or whatever his name is. Um, so Eugene has to go to the bathroom. Is he almost done leveling up? Uh, I don't want him to pee his pants. So let's just have him stop. And then, um, I guess he can go back back home after he goes to the bathroom. Valerie's home as well. I'm going to have her actually go ahead and go to the city hall and check for a street art commission and then hopefully we can get some money from that. Now she's wearing this outfit again which isn't the one that I gave her. I think this is like some weird glitch because um, I changed her outfit in the last episode so there we go. That, those, that, those are her new colors. She's all bright and orange and stuff. Uh, Alright so check for the street art commission and um Alright, so, uh, what, what game is this that they're playing? A bear? What is this? I've never seen this before. Huh. It looks kind of like a, like an Animal Crossing game now. Um, just like an animal, some sort of animal game. Uh, alright, anyways, probably like a game that EA made. Um, but yeah, so Tina, uh, Eugene's coming home. And then Valerie is at City Hall. We should be getting a... Oh, what's this? Objective. Participate in study at the science facility before time runs out to earn some money. Sure, why not? We can do that now. Um, and then... After Tina's done uh, disposing the dead plants, which is going to take her a long time because she's going to have to go back and forth, um, I'm going to have her plants two... Only, only two of these... Only the red berry beans and the Kona beans because they produce money when you sell them. So, like, a lot more money than anything else. So, right now, we'll actually just sell these because um, we don't really need them at all. But we'll keep the other ones. Now, all of these sample things, I really don't know what to do with them. They're kind of just clogging up our inventory. I'll keep them just in case we, like, lose a forbidden fruit plant and we need to plant one again. And, like, these, sometimes if you, like, research them, they give you them, but... I don't even know. I, I have no idea. So, Valerie is playing Kiki Ball, but we're gonna have her uh, go ahead. Oh my gosh, she's playing with just this random dude with his name Ethan Bunch. Uh, ooh, there's a flower from Seasons. Let's pick it up because usually they give some good money. Um, let's tag or do a ground, a large ground mural. Um, the good thing I think about doing street art in. Um, in your neighborhood is that you don't get arrested, I don't believe. I mean, we're doing it in the city hall, so, um, I, I, I mean, we should, but we don't. But in university, the university neighborhood, we do, so, um, don't have to worry about that. Because I've done it plenty of times, and she hasn't gotten arrested, so, yeah. Um, there's a party going on, but I don't want them to attend it. Um, let's see how much this thing, oh, wow, 400 simoleons, that's pretty good. Um, 
But hopefully this becomes a masterpiece and she'll then she'll be oh, she'll only have two. I thought she had another one. Does it get reset every time she goes back to university? That's so annoying if it does. Um, alright, so I'll just leave her alone to do that and then we'll get a thousand simoleons and it'll be that'll be good. Alright, so Tina's still disposing the dead plants because she has to to get the plant and then go all the way around to the front of the house and then throw it away, but that's fine. Um, Eugene's doing that. After he's done, I'll go, let him go home. Alright, you can stop playing video games now, Marcus, and uh, before you become a full-on nerd. I just wanted him to do it so his fun would be up. Um, so I'll just have him get something to eat, take a shower, and um, actually work on his book. I don't know if he's actually writing one right now. Yeah, he is. It's called The Full Moon Tea. Um, and then, uh, yeah, so let's just speed this up. And, uh, Eugene's, or er, Tina's kind of tired, so after she's done, I'll have her go to sleep. Um, alright, your body reacted entirely differently to the physical stimulus. Fascinating. It's interesting to see that mind over body is perhaps a valid theory and something science should investigate further. Here's some money to thank you for your time and discomfort. Oh, lovely. Um, okay, so, looks like now Tina is just, uh, throwing out the forbidden plant forbidden fruit plant okay so let's go ahead and plant this and uh oops let's actually plant many all right so we'll plant these um this is a really unorganized garden but it's fine i don't really care that much okay oh one more uh right there or er, two more uh right there or 500 more what the heck <laughs> um okay uh, another one can just go here oh my gosh how many are there okay I didn't think that there would be that many. Okay, so everyone in town really enjoyed seeing your art. Alright, it, was it a masterpiece? No, it was an urban work of art. Alright, I need to work on her and getting uh, some masterpieces. That actually didn't take too long, so let's have her go home and do another ground mural. Or actually, I'm going to try a wall mural, see if that gives her a masterpiece. Because um, I, I think the larger ones uh, give you more, like, are more commonly to give you, um... Uh, a masterpiece? I don't even know. So let's uh, do a large wall mural right here um, and see what it gives us. Okay, and Eugene, are you, you're you not very high with your book, so you can. I guess you can just stop. Um, he wants to read newspapers, but I think I'll just X out of that opportunity because I don't see that happening anytime soon. Um, Alright, so let's just have him go to sleep, and Eugene is go sleeping right now, but I'm actually going to wake him up just because he's hungry, so I don't kind of don't really want him to, um, oh, this counter's dirty, let's clean that and then, uh, do that, because I don't want him to starve when in the middle of the night, so. Alright, then he can go, uh, back to sleep, and Tina can go to sleep, and, uh, everyone is just going to go to sleep and stuff. Alright, go to sleep. And Valerie is in a really bad mood. I'm actually gonna have her stop tagging the wall. And, uh, oh my gosh, this isn't good. Alright, go here, get out of the way, and then you can eat something. Okay, good job. Alright. So, alright, they're gonna eat, and then they're gonna clean up, and then they're gonna go to sleep. Uh, I think this episode was actually really short, a lot shorter than my other ones, but I don't think that it's really necessary to speed through their sleeping and then get back to you guys, because I think I'll just pick up in the next episode. I think in the next episode, uh, I'll just, I'll skill up a lot on, off camera, and then, um, and then wait for the forbidden fruit plant to grow, and then hopefully we'll get a plant sim baby, and, uh, but the thing is, is that if we do get a plant sim baby, um, It'll be a, I don't think it can be left here alone while we're in university, so we might have to have someone stay behind. Um, I'm thinking Valerie, because she's kind of a rebel and she doesn't really want to, to, to go back and she's just, she'll, she likes her career and stuff like that. So I'm thinking that could be a good idea. But anyways, I'm going to end this episode here, guys. If you have any uh, suggestions or whatever, uh, leave a comment. And, and if you know if we go back to university, if we lose our uh, progression in our careers, tell me in the comments below. But anyway, if you enjoyed this episode, don't forget to leave a like and a comment. And if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe. I will see you guys in the next episode.